Hey, we're here, guys. Uh, it's late Sunday night. Not too many people. Maybe more will pop up. Uh, what's up? It's 2017 Allen and Ginter. Four box break. Number 16. We got a fresh case. Thank you for joining my uh, my late people. Okay, let's get this going. So I was rushing from the last break. Oh, but we made. All right, A and G fresh case. Oh, I love fresh cases. All right, there is our fresh case. Hopefully that number is good. 1917 CM1. Every box is different. Sometimes there's all different things. Sometimes there's like no printing on it. There's a sticker on it. I don't know. I guess it depends on where it comes from. Just make sure we're good to go. I think we are. Yep, good to go. All right, guys. Hey, Tony. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Sometimes uh, it's only a few people late Sunday, and then within a few minutes, there'll be like 12 people. Right now, it says five people watching, so maybe a little West Coast action. All right, let's rip this open and uh, pick four boxes. Okay. I got two fresh cases of Ginter, so we got six breaks worth, so tonight's one, and then we got another five breaks that'll be throughout the week. Uh, Tops Chrome, we opened up a fresh case tonight. There's two more breaks of that uh, Thursday and Friday night, one, one on each night. And on Tuesday, I got to check with my distributor. I got to grab another case or two, probably two maybe three more cases to get us through till Wednesday when uh, Heritage comes out. And that's when a string of like new products will start coming out. It's Heritage, then Triple Threads, then um, Bowman Chrome is the big one. Week after week, it's just going to be uh, new releases. And then uh, High Tech comes out, Tops Heritage, Minor League comes out. There's like five products. Uh, within three weeks. Pretty crazy. Alright, let's number these. Actually, let's roll a dice and pick a row. Uh, one, two, we'll do the left. Three, four, we'll do the middle. Five, six, we'll do the right. <laughs> What's up, Michael? Yeah, no, breaks are fun to watch, even if you're not in them. You get to see some cards. Allen and Ginter's been really good to us, too. We've seen some really nice cards. Alright, there's the dice. No trick dice. All right, we got a five. So we're going to do the right side. It's upside down, so that's actually probably the left side. Not that it matters. All right, I'm going to number these so we can uh, we can choose another four boxes for the next break. And you know it's from the same case. See, like that two's all jacked up. Make sure you look for that two, and you know it's the same case at the next break. And the five's a little jacked up. That's the fingerprint. All right, let's get rid of these. Even, oh, you like even numbers? <laughs> yeah, we all got our superstitions. Oh, man. All right, here are your teams. Let me show you the list. All right, now people are starting to pop up. I knew it. All right, there you go. You always see Raiders 2010 with the bottom two spots there. Bottom three spots. There you go. So this is break number 16, fresh case. All right.
right, it is Sunday night or Monday morning. We had a really good weekend of breaks. A lot of nice cards out of uh, Clearly Authentic. We got a Kershaw to 25. We got an Aaron Judge Redemption. Uh, we got a nice Noah Syndergaard auto. Uh, what else? Thank you, Frank. Good luck to all. And then, uh, what did we hit? We hit a sick, sick booklet out of Allen and Ginter. The last three boxes last night. Uh, Chris Bryant, Anthony Rizzo. You know, those are all going to ship Tuesday because of the holiday. So I get to hang out with them a little longer. Yeah, I'm going to show one more time. And Sarah, who won this, has been hitting crazy stuff. This is her second booklet. The other one was a Josh Donaldson booklet. I could stare at that all day. That's just so nice looking. The patches are perfect. Love that Brian Auto. Let's get one of these in here. All right. You know, if I see the thick pack, I get excited. Uh, where's Trey? Yeah, what happened to Trey? <laughs> Trey and his buddy. His buddy, uh, what's his name? Trey and, I think on Instagram, he's Money Gold. Money Gold. All right, get the dust. All right, let's get this going. Good luck, everybody. Congrats to the winners uh, who won the hobby packs today at the random. Please let me know if you get any good autos or any good, uh, like, one-of-one one refractors or something out of the 2013 Prism. You know, a bunch of people told me all the nice stuff they got. You know, a couple people said they didn't get much, but not every single... Uh, pack or 10 packs or five packs or whatever you get is going to have good stuff all right our first box topper i'd love to hit an auto no the autos are tough but we pulled two of them already out of like five cases all right john carlos stanton miami marlins that's nice for the marlins I think the Marlins went for the most I've ever seen them go. I think when I checked, it was at like $30 the last I checked, which is really high for the Marlins. So let's hope we get an Ichiro. This would be the product to spend a little extra on the Marlins, though. Because it's got some of those like Ichiros and, you know, I'm sure you could get a Stanton booklet or something. All right, there's that. Yeah, let's get another dinosaur bone. Let's see anything thick. All right, nothing thick yet. We could still get good cards, but it's not going to be a super thick card. All right, good luck. Here we go. We'll take a good look at the first pack. Because there's always somebody who's new to the break and uh, hasn't seen the cards. You know, you see most of them, but uh, we go a little faster after the first pack. Oh, was it really, Frank? Did it get, you think it got ruined in the, yeah, let me know. I'll take care of you with that. I'm glad you let me know. Try to ship them safe. I put like the packing peanuts and... Now I started putting, like, cardboard in between them. It was bent pretty bad. Uh, I guess the mailman or the post office mishandled it. Try to protect it from them. Was it, like, crease on the middle or, like, the corner? Was it, was it just jacked up? Yeah, anytime that happens, I'll take care of you, so. Chapman, Machado, Frazier, uh, Northern Pikefish. You know, I've delivered a you know ton of like couple thousand packages. Very rarely will something get damaged. I think maybe twice I've heard of that. You know, 
The bottom corner. Oh, that's bad. I'm sorry, Frank. I'm going to... You know, I try to ship them as safe as possible. Now I'm reinforcing them. I'm putting cardboard on both ends of them. That way there's nothing, like, sticking out if the mailman, like, throws it or something. Todd Frazier Mini. That's a regular one. Richards and Katz. Uh, I'm going to refund you. Which uh, box topper was it? What was the player? What team spot was that? Yeah, if anything's damaged, I you know, I'll definitely take care of you. I don't like to. Yeah, no, I started doing the cardboard. I thought I was good with the peanuts and uh, getting everything wedged in good. But yeah, I have to go with the cardboard now. Oof. Yeah, I hate to hear that. All right, Ben Zobris, Jorge Soler, Segura, Arietta Insert. We got the football coach. All right, this is a Kirby Smart no number. But I will make it up to you. You know, I'll talk to you uh, tomorrow, and I'll let you know what I'll do. But I'll definitely take care of you. Uh, that's a no number. Those are pretty rare. One in every 80 packs or something. So that's a no number for the non-baseball spot. And every post office is different. Every mailman's different. Some of them are... Some of the postal employees get... Uh, get mad like when you're I don't know they just don't seem happy especially if you come at the end of the day when they're closing and you see them like throwing packages and stuff they're all different though Daryl Reznor buyback that is what team is that oh Nationals got a DC logo on it okay cool you know what I'm gonna refund you for the Orioles spot Frank so whatever that whole spot costs, so just take all the cards for free. I apologize about the box stopper. Just um, I'll talk to you tomorrow, and I'll send over a pay. I'll try to send the payment tonight, but uh, if not, I'll send it by like tomorrow. Depends how late we finish this break, how tired I get. All right. Hank Aaron, Xander Bogarts, World's Fair X-Ray Machine, Kevin Kiermeyer A and G back. No, that's what I do. I'm telling you, not many things get damaged, but the couple times it does happen. I've been selling for, I think like three years now, and only like, I swear like twice somebody's let me know that something got damaged. You know, every now and then, it will happen. I try to avoid that as much as possible, you know. Maybe I thought I had it in good and it just like adjusted during shipment. But uh, no, I take complete blame for that. Right, Ozzy Smith, Clemente, Beltre, Joey Votto, what a day. Uh, Chilean sailor dude. Thank you, Michael. No, that's the right thing to do. You guys pay a lot of money for these cards. You guys keep me in business. Jake Lamb. We got a Dave Steve buyback for the Blue Jays. <clears throat> 1988 tops. Yeah, no, that's what I usually do. Sometimes, sometimes I'll think I have it in good and I'm kind of rushing. And I guess that particular package didn't work out. You know, I think it's in perfectly straight, and I got the packing peanuts. Uh, <clears throat> you know, I have a lot of different shipping supplies. You know, I probably thought it was good, but but now I definitely do the cardboard on like every box topper. Some more fish. All right, first hit: Detroit Tigers, Justin Verlander. Boom. Congrats to the Tigers. Who's got the Tigers? Sarah. You get the first hit. Sarah's been on the hot streak.
But uh, yeah, don't be afraid to message me uh, after you get it delivered. If anything's damaged, just let me know. You know, I'd rather you tell me than not, just so I know. And I can uh, see what I did wrong, you know. And fix it up and take care of you. Miguel Cotto Mini. Donaldson and Greinke. You know, with all the cases I buy, I uh, started saving every single box. You know, I can't save them all, but I uh, started saving a lot of them and, you know, taking advantage of them for the box toppers. You know, a couple of products at box toppers. This is one of them. Corey Seeger insert. Stephen Vogt short print, card number 338. And then sometimes there's like, you know, I, there was one point that there was like, a hundred and almost two hundred like uh, team spots to like pack out, maybe like over a hundred packages or something. And I'm trying to get it done quick, and you know that's probably what happened. Rushed, and that's what happens. Real Muto, Stark, Shields, Pedroia, the Atomium, uh, Ali LaForce, A and G back. Blackman and Jonas. Josh Bell, Roark Bench, Velasquez, Batista. All right, we got a Dan Jennings black border for the Marlins. Executive for the Marlins. All right, Yasmani Tomas, Andrew Benintendi, rookie. It's going to go in the hot rookie pile, sleeved up. Winfield, Frank Thomas insert. We got a dude, we got a Scottish dude. Uh, Pete Alonzo, no idea. I don't know anything about him. Is he like a, like a up-and-coming player? Pete Alonzo, like in the minors? Spawn, Contreras. All right, we got a Sil Camposano buyback. 1989 tops for the Blue Jays. Another big name on these buybacks. On your team. Oh, what, on the Mets? Pete Alonzo, I have no idea. I know the Mets drafted some guys. He's what is he a 2016 draft guy? I don't know too much about those guys yet. I'm still getting to know um Dominic Smith and uh Ahmed Rosario, Dilson Herrera, Encarnacion, Schneider Hands, Piscotti. All right, next hit after the Statue of Liberty, LA Dodgers Julio Urias relic. It's like the 20 or 21 year old pitcher for the Dodgers. He's going to have a good career if he stays healthy. Very talented. And he is on the right pitching staff right now. Yeah, no, I'll look into him. I've been uh I've been busy and I've not been studying my like prospects or anything lately. Oh, we forgot about these Kyle Freeland mini Eric Cosmer. That's an A and G back for the Rockies. AJ Reed, Chris Archer, Brian the Golfer, Dansby Swanson, what a day. Right, another Ali LaForce. This one is a black border. You're gonna get your Ali LaForce rainbow unless we what was the uh, the first one was an A and G back? Salarte may have been Sandy Koufax. You know the name was ringing a bell, Tony. Pete Alonso. I hope he's good. All right, Chicago White Sox. You won Mancata rookie card. Hot rookie pile. D Gordon, Almora, Jaselman, Trout. Not Mike. 
Sung Kwan O, oh, short print for the Cardinals. Right, Andrew Miller, Chad Pinder, George Springer, Adam Jones insert. We got a Hank Aaron mini. That's a regular one. Hanley Ramirez, Hamilton, Giant Panda. Urias, Darvish, Cole, Severino, Battle of Quebec. We got uh, Tom Anderson, MySpace co-founder. John Gray, Manny Margot. Oh, really? Yeah, that was one of the 2016 guys. Yeah, there was a couple of guys. Uh, I think they had two or three first-round picks. I don't know too much about them. But uh, as they get talked about and they come up a little, I'll start to get to know them a little more. And I just had to take a break from uh, like baseball news for a little bit. For years and years, just nothing but sports radio and MLB Network. Uh, just had to get my brain... You know, obviously I'm always focusing on the cards, but uh, had to get into something else for a little bit too. Derek Jeter, Pedro Martinez, Derek Jeter insert... Got a Xander Bogarts mini. I'll let you know uh, if the minis are like parallels or anything. Yeah, I definitely will. Especially if he's playing for my team. Bats, Pujols, Mustakis, Randy Johnson, Rainbow Trout. Uh, P.T. Selbit, Magician and Illusionist. Carlos Correa, Lou Gehrig. Yeah, I've been watching like a lot of mafia movies and documentaries. I was just trying to switch it up for a little bit, break up the monotony a little. Like I love sports. Not like I plan to take a break, but like when Vikings the show comes on, you know, I get really into Vikings, so that takes up some of my sports time. And now the mafia stuff got my brain on something else for a little bit. Rosenthal story, Murphy. And with the Mets doing so bad, like, there wasn't much to pay attention to. I'm still rooting for the Mets. I'm not, like, a front runner. Steven Piscotty Mini. Reyes Marte. But definitely more exciting when your team's, uh, like, in a playoff race. And they were just getting rid of all the vets. I was getting a little ticked off that we have to rebuild again. Herrera. Crazy George. Maeda. King Felix. Andrew McCutcheon insert. We got a Vashti Cunningham. She's a gymnast. A and G back. Keikel and Puig. Rodon, Molina, Longoria, Giolito, Biosphere. Uh, Danny Salazar short print for the Indians. Card number 325. Manganiello and a Ledmus Diaz. Ramos, Seeger, Belmore, Gritchuk. Xander Bogarts, what a day. We got a big unit mini. Let's see if this is numbered or something. Nope, regular mini. The old school purple hat. Now they're like all black and red. Really cool snake uh, logo, though, with the D-backs. All right, looks like a frame. All right, good luck, everyone. Could be a relic, could be an auto. Renfro, Gregorius, Matt Weeders. Habitats, oh, it's some ink. Let's see what we got. Habitat 67. And behind Stark, we got a Roman Quinn mini-framed auto for the Phillies. And the Phillies, uh, Marine Corps, congrats. Marine Corps 2008-2016. Yeah, there's a good chance it's a rip card. There's two or three in every case, so the odds are with us. Barry Larkin. All right, very nice. That's the Philadelphia's uh, rookie spokesman. 
Roman Quinn is all over the place. All right, Donnie Baseball, Damon Steel, Cargo. We got another Smart Mini. That's a regular one. Build his rainbow now. Cologne, Zimmerman, Trout. All right, Chris Brown, not the rapper. The singer. Singer slash rapper. Chris Brown. Wow, I remember getting that card. Him and Chili Davis. 1987 tops for the Giants. All right, Reyes, Ryan Healy, rookie, Villar, Battle of Calpens. All right, Dave Winfield. All right, last pack of box one. Hunter Pence, Paris Locks, Thor, Freddie Freeman insert. We got some required reading the Canterbury Tales. Ozuna, Arenado, Matt Harvey. All right, not too much action in that first box. You know, a couple relics and auto, nothing crazy. All right, box number two. Yeah, I watched the... Uh what I watched today, an old mob movie, like a black and white movie. It was called uh, Machine Gun Kelly, like an old famous mobster like Dillinger, you know, kind of like Bonnie and Clyde era. Pretty cool, you know, I'm not into too many like black and white movies and stuff, but uh, I don't know, kind of, I guess I'm getting older. I can appreciate it a little bit. Right, Dansby Swanson, box topper, Atlanta Braves. We pull one of those per case, at least. All right, the Braves. Uh, Kevin, congrats, you got a box topper. Okay, nothing super thick from what I see. Good luck, guys. Box two. All right, Jorge Soler. He was so much cooler when he was a cubby. I guess he got a lot more popularity with the Cubs. Bogarts, Chad Pinder, Sandy Koufax. We got the Charleston Dance. All right, we got a black frame. These are numbered to 25. Let's see what we got. Maybe this break will start to heat up now. Batista, Andrew Miller, George Springer. Redfish from Dr. Seuss. All right, we got a black. It is 16 out of 25. It's behind this Jarrell Cotton black border. Yeah, let's get the back card. Joe Musgrove behind it. Good luck, everybody. Anybody know what that is? No idea. All right, nice. Bradley Zimmer, Cleveland Indians. That's a nice one. He's one of their big prospects. Bradley Zimmer to 25. That's sweet. 16 out of 25. Yep, Bradley Zimmer, Cleveland Indians. Who's got the Indians? Uh, Tony Sabell won. Congrats. Let 
Yeah, he was a pretty high draft pick. Forgot what number he was picked, but uh, I think he was a 2014 draft, I want to say. And in the minors, he was talked about at moments. Don't know uh, if he's even up playing right now, if he's still in the minors. See, when you put the sleeve on, it does not focus, but here we go. It'll focus now. Sweet. Congrats, Indians. All right, and we got that right away. I'd love to hit like a crazy buyback. Well, there's a good player. Urias, Darvish, Randy Johnson, uh, Lou Gehrig Mini, Giant Panda, and we got a Tony Gwen buyback. That's pretty cool. It's nowhere near his rookie card, but it's Tony Gwen for the Padres. Not bad at all. That's uh, 1999 tops. He was a rookie in 82, so this is like one of the last years he played. And you can see a little gut he's got there. <laughs> he's getting a little old. Metabolism going down. But great player, Tony Gwynn. Uh, another buyback. All right, Josh Bell, Pedroia, Altuve. Uh, the violin dude. There he is. Sung Kwan Oh, Charlie Blackman, Nick Jonas, and we got a BJ Surhoff. He was on the Mar uh, the Brewers most of his career. This is for the Orioles. BJ Surhoff. He was a fan favorite. I think Topps Archives had him in the fan favorite autographs. Johnny Bench, Velasquez, Trout, the fish trout. All right, Carlos Correa Mini. That would be, that's a regular. That'd be good if it was numbered. Manny Machado Relic, Baltimore Orioles. Uh, Christian, LRS21905. Congrats. Nice black piece of Manny Machado's uh, jersey. All right, one of the premier young players in the game right here. And Luke Weaver. All right, David Dahl. Derek Jeter, diesel engine World's Fair. That's when they introduced the diesel engine. Uh, Tyler Glass now A and G back for the Pirates. John Gray, many more go. Mookie Betts, Pedro Mustakis, Bo Jackson insert. Uh, DJ LeMahieu. That is a regular one. Justin Turner, Mitch Haniger, Carlos Correa. Right, Prince Albert, Yasmani Tomas, Randy Johnson, Dave Winfield, Battle of Bunker Hill, Harmon Killebrew Mini, that's a short print, card number 318. Lou Gehrig, Mark Trumbo. Right, Andrew Benintendi, rookie card. That's uh, number two on the Benny. Carnacion, the golfer, Piscotti. Ozzy Smith, what a day insert. Dustin Pedroia, mini. Tim Raines, that's a short print. Wilson Contreras. Reed, Yohan Mankata for the White Sox. That's number two on Mankata. Bass. Uh, another DJ LeMayhew. That's an A and G back for the Rockies. Hosmer and Mabin. P. 
Pete Alonzo, pick 64. He must have done something in the minors to make the value go up. Yeah, sometimes there's a guy from the second round or third round that lights it up in the minors. And everybody wants to prospect him. Arietta, Greg Bird, he's back. Jason Worth, Chris Sale, insert. We got uh, Ryan Zimmerman, A&G back. There's your A&G logo. Jansen and Doolittle, a couple of closers. You know why he's going for good money? Why, Tony? He's had to have done something. Maybe he threw a... Oh, I don't even know if he's a pitcher or not. Threw a no-hitter or hit three home runs in a game. All right, A&G back. Sage Steele. Vote Richards Cats. Chapman, Zobris, Gene Segura, Hank Aaron, Solar Generator, World's Fair. We got a Blake Snell Mini for the Rays. Tulo Mazzara. Clayton Kershaw. We got a Jake Thompson mini, rookie mini for the Phillies. Trey Mancini, our first Mancini. Cal Ripken, Ernie Banks. A couple of nice Orioles. Ozzy Smith. Adrian Beltre, Space Needle. Paris Locks Mini, A and G back. Lamb and Donaldson. Clemente, Cunningham, Sanchez, Francisco Lindor, Kyle Schwarber insert. We got a Max Scherzer Mini, regular Mini for Scherzer. Shipley and Greinke. Let's see, maybe one of these two boxes will be a hot box. There's a, a hot box in every case. Um, I'm always expecting monsters. I mean, the Zimmer to 25 is a nice auto. But I don't know if I consider that a monster yet. I don't think he's, like, proven himself. Unless I'm wrong and that thing's worth crazy, but I think it's just a nice card. So we've been spoiled, you know. So I'm just waiting for the big crazy cart to come. Let's hope it comes. Maybe more than one. Lance McCullough short print. Short print A and G back. So these are a little tougher to get for the Astros. Jose Canseco. Stanton, Semyon, Smart, Fulmer, Pendulum, Clock. Got a Brandon Belt Mini. The Big Hurt, Christian Yelich. Even like last break, uh, wasn't going so good. The uh, Topps Chrome. You know, we... Uh, you know, the autos weren't popping up good. And then next thing you know, we pull a Chris Bryant Red Refractor, number to five. Change the whole landscape of that. couple other nice refractors. A Bryce Harper green refractor popped up. Right, Bo Jackson, Will Myers, Orlando Arcia. What a day, Ichiro. Uh, Brandon Phillips, Black Border. Anthony Rizzo, and we got a 1989 buyback, Chuck Carey. And that is a uh, top straight. It's, see, it's a little brighter in the back, and it's got the T on the numbering, 17T. Always love the backs of those cards. Mm. 
Maguire, DeGrom, uh, Bluefin Tuna. All right, some required reading. This is Jane Eyer, Charlotte Bronte. That's one book I haven't heard of, Charlotte Bronte. Sounds like Charles Bronson. Greg Maddox, Corey Kluber insert. Uh, we got the zookeeper dude hanging out with his alligator. All right, an Olsen rookie for the Athletics. And we got a Terry Pendleton buyback, St. Louis Cardinals. Oh, Bo Bichette. Yeah, Bo Bichette is the son of Dante Bichette, who played for the Rockies and was a good player. And uh, he's supposed to be a really good minor league player. Yeah, a lot of their sons uh, play ball, too. Not all of them turn out to be like uh, the Griffies. But uh, Bichette looks like the real deal. We'll see. And I hope Pete Alonso turns out good. The Mets need uh, all the help they can get right now. Healthy help. Clemens, Wagner, Battle of Guilford Courthouse. And our next relic. Pulled a bunch of these. Uh, Peter Rosenberg, Hot 97 DJ. He's got that red swatch of something. I don't know if it's the hat he's wearing or maybe a sweater of his. Going to the non-baseball spot. All right, Peter Rosenberg. And what else we got? Vincent Velasquez, mini for the Phils. Ken Griffey Jr. and Jesse Winker. Yeah, I saw a special on Bo Bichette and um, another player who has a father who played ball. They were really hyping up Bo Bichette. You know, that's the stuff that will make a, a product jump up. Like 2016 will get popular again. Ricky Henderson, Tulo. You know, there were no, uh, what was it? I think that was the Mickey Moniak out of 2016 draft. But there was no Senzel Auto, though. Trey Turner. Senzel popped up this year in uh, 2017 Bowman. Bagwell's a short print for the Astros. Babe Ruth. All right, last pack of box two. <laughs> Piece of his silk boxers or something. His Burberry drawers. <laughs> All right, Big Poppy, Jose Abreu, Enciarte, Alexa Dat. That's his wife, by the way. These two are married. Lucky dude, huh? Uh, Barracuda. We got a Stephen Wright short print for the Red Sox. Altuve and Maris. All right, box number three. 2016 draft. Yep, see, I didn't get too much of that. Um, That came out around the same time as Bowman's Best. I got a little more Bowman's Best, I think. I really like Bowman's Best. But uh, I think at that time I was, you know, chilling out with the cards a little and getting ready for the case breaking. I was setting everything up, saving money to get this whole set, you know, like the desk and the chair and the computer and the, get money for the cases of cards and the accountant and doing all the uh, government stuff I needed to do to start the business. Because that's the only way you're going to get cases from a distributor. You got to have a tax ID number. You got to have a business ID number. All right, box topper number three. 
right, it's a good name. Right, Houston Astros, Alex Bregman. So we got the Swanson box topper. Now we got the Bregman. And that's the Astros. Uh, Jay Robin, there's your box topper. I have pulled a bunch of Bregman autos out of this product. Maybe we'll get one of those in a little bit. All right, good luck, box three. A very familiar back. That was my childhood right there. And the smell of these are like very, just brings me back to like 1987, 86. 88, that's 88. Grandy Man, Brandon Belt. Pedro, we got a dude. Oh, this is my dad. The machinist dude. When I was like, you know, really young, seven, eight years old, my dad used to take me to work. And those are the kind of machines we worked on right there. You know, we take them apart, fix the motors, uh, scrape them, paint them. It was fun while it lasted, but me and my dad couldn't get along. I had to leave the family business when I was like 22 or 23 years old. But I uh, worked my whole childhood there, you know, up until my early 20s. Really hard physical labor. A big difference from what I'm doing now. Willie Hernandez buyback for the Tigers. So yeah, I left that and then I went into the food business and then I learned how to be a cook and I learned how to manage uh, like New York delis and bagel stores. And then I did that for a while and got really sick of it. Couldn't wait to leave. World's Fair Ferris Wheel. And another Masahiro Tanaka Relic. Seems like every break we get a Tanaka Relic going out to the Yankees. Masahiro Tanaka... Very talented dude, and he stayed healthy this year. Unless he got injured recently, and I don't know about it. But I think he was struggling for a little while, but uh, he's got great stuff. If he's healthy in the playoffs, he would uh, help the Yankees out a lot. You know, they need him as the ace. Severino had a great year. Hopefully he's still doing his thing too. All right, Jerickson Profar A&G back. Ali LaForce, William Shatner. Batanzas, Kluber, Snell, John Smoltz. Uh, Joe Musgrove Mini, right, Cano Abreu, right, Anderson, Aranola, Verlander, Battle of Chesapeake, uh, we got a Nick Jonas Mini, Glazier, Nolan Ryan. George Brett, Miguel Cotto, the big cat, Jackie Robinson, and we got the Waltz, bust the move. Smiley and Andrus. You know, the non-baseball spots, if you put together, like, the dude sets and the bust the move set and the fish set and all the other sets, you know, I'm sure they go for at least 10 bucks for the complete sets. You know, put them all together and sell them all. Oh, J. Ja, what's up, J. Ja? Jackson Robinson. The Raiders Zoo got a $1,200 dinosaur tooth the other night, though. So, you know, takes a little risk, but uh, paying. And he got some gold. 
The gold goes for like two, three hundred bucks. Uh, Wahoo. Billy Hamilton. Peter Rosenberg. Steven Matz. But some nights it goes for, le you know, a little less. I've seen the Yankee spots go for like 70, which is... The first couple weeks they were going for like almost 200 like every night. And the non-baseball spot. But they were averaging 150 for the most part. Now I think they're a little lower than that. Closer to 100. Conforto, there's our first Aaron Judge. Hayward, Bryce Harper, what a day. Jeff Bagwell, short print mini, card number 350. That was the last uh, short print in the set, card 350. Trees in India, Stroman. All right, Mr. Judge. Clayton Kershaw, Albert Pujols. Uh, a and G back, Max Kepler for the Twins. Brooke Hogan. Dimitri Young. The Atomium. All right, we got a Francisco Lindor Mini. That is a regular one. No numbering on the back or anything. Anderson and Duval. Polanco, Freeland, Gordon, Carpenter, Northern Pike. Uh, we got a Mankata Black Border. That's a nice one for the White Sox. You know what? Everybody's got their own method of doing things. You know, if you wanted to get the case hits and you go to buy a case of cards, you know, spending twelve, thirteen hundred, or if you spend whatever, a couple hundred to get the two big spots in a break or something. And then you hit the case hit. But uh, I'll know to each one's own. If you want to buy boxes, you want to join case breaks. Just another way of collecting. Olsen and Winker. Because if you're just looking for the non-baseball cards, you know, you're better off joining the break to just get the non-baseball things from the case. Rather than spend the... I don't know what they retail for in the stores, but I'm sure it's like over a hundred a box. All right, Maddox, Clemens, Wagner, Legrand, Robbie Cano, what a day. J. Bruce Mini, Ken Griffey Jr. Big Poppy, Ricky Henderson, X-Ray Machine, World's Fair, uh, Brett Gardner, A&G back, Babe Ruth, Hernandez, Abreu, Gaussman, Alexa Dad, Eric Cosmer. Uh, we got the New York Ferreter dude. He's got a couple of ferrets. Oh, we got to check out those ferrets. There they are. Everybody loves ferrets. Ramirez, Altuve, Maris, Scott Terry, 
Yeah, no, case breaking's popular. You know, there's a reason people do it, but uh, everybody does their own thing. And it's fun, you know, they get the entertainment of watching all the cards and... Oh, I think we got a rip. We got a rip card. Here we go. You know, I would buy boxes and I would join breaks. So I do, you know, and everybody's got a different budget. Not everybody has the money to spend on them. You know, so we all have different situations. But there's no wrong way to collect. McGuire, Kipnis, <clears throat> as long as you're having fun, you know. Uh, T206 cards. I don't, but I kind of like them. I always wanted to get a couple of those, Frankie. Obviously not the Onus Wagner one, but... Wanted to get a couple of old ones just to have in the collection. Alright, John Lester's a short print A&G back for the Cubbies. Alright, and behind the Statue of Liberty, good luck everyone. That is numbered 59 out of 60. Who's going to get it? All right, Andrew Benintendi. That's a nice one. I don't know if that's one that you rip. That's his rookie year. Uh, McCarthy 99 with the Benintendi rip card. That's awesome right there. Congrats, McCarthy. Yeah, it's a pretty sick one. Since it's his rookie year, I don't know if they would rip that. I can't rip it, Tony. <laughs> and I don't know if McCarthy's watching right now. Uh, but if McCarthy's watching and you want me to rip it, just uh, hit it up in the chat. But that's a good one, Benintendi. Especially if he becomes like a Hall of Famer. Maybe we get another rip card. Let's see. We've gotten two in a break before. Baez, Jock Peterson, Onis Wagner. Uh, Jose Peraza, Black Border. Ripken Jr., Banks. Tom Edens, buyback 1991 tops for the Brewers. Yeah, you'd rip up that Benintendi, right, Tone? Would you? Or you'd save it? That one, I don't know if I'd want to rip Benintendi. I know you don't rip like a trout. You could save that and uh, just buy like a, a cheaper one to rip up. Unless they put better mini cards than like the better cards, I don't know. Like the double rip cards, do they put like more autographs and stuff in there? No idea. Greg Bird, Worth, Battle of Quebec. All right, next up, Chicago Cubs, Anthony Rizzo. Cubs always have a lot of relics. All right, who got the Cubbies? Uh, Shaq, 131K, Kevin. Congrats, Kevin. You got a little uh, Rizzo relic action. All right, what else we got? Uh, that's a crazy magician or illusionist. William Ellsworth Robinson. Sean Doolittle. All right, Tyler Austin, rookie. The Grominator. Ken Griffey Jr., what a day. A.J. Pollock, A&G back. <laughs> Warren Spahn, Martinez. All right. Wow, J. Jaws attacking you, Tony. I know he's just kidding. All right, John Carlos Stanton, Smart, Fulmer, Mike Trout, Brian Dozier, 
Wainwright, Thomas, Yelich. You know, whatever the spots go for, whatever he pays for, that means somebody else was trying to win the spot at that same price. So that's just what they're going for. That's just the market now for those teams and those spots. Yeah, baseball's been really hot this year. It's a very booming market. All right, hopefully it just keeps getting better and better. Orlando Arcia rookie card. Rainbow Trout. Uh, Miguel Sano. Sean Manea, Anthony Rizzo. All right, Smith, Clemente, Beltre, Spotted Sea Trout, Brandon Finnegan Mini. All right, almost at the end of box three. Francisco Lindor. Reggie Jackson, Ruggie Odor, Mini, Zimmerman, Greinke, Pollock. Pedroia, Habitat 67, Cameron Mabin, A and G back for the Angels, Conseco and Blackman. Josh Bell. This guy's going to be a good player. I think he's having a decent rookie year. Alex Bregman, insert. Uh, Matt Moore. That's a short print for the Giants. And last pack of box three. Machado, Battle of Cow Pens. All right, we got an Ichiro Mini. All right, one more box to go, everybody. Oof, would you get Tops Inception or, uh, well, Bowman Inception didn't come out yet, right? It's just uh, Tops Inception. Always good to hit on those because there's not too many, you know, not too many cards in those. So when you hit, that's always good. Origins. Oh, so you did good today. All right. All right, last box. Doesn't look like anything super thick. Let's hope we get uh, another rip card or some kind of crazy auto. Good luck, everybody. Yeah, you know what? On this YouTube channel, uh, there's a link to my Instagram. It's in like one of the sections to the right. You know, hit the Instagram button. You could see all the stuff we've hit, some crazy stuff. Hit a Chris Bryan Super Fractor Auto, one out of one. Uh, a Mike Trout, Chris Bryant, double auto, one of one. A um, lot, a lot of crazy stuff. You know, last night we hit this sick Chris Bryant and uh, Anthony Rizzo double booklet, double patch auto. Uh, dinosaur, yeah, I think it's only hobby exclusive. It's uh, the Gems and Ancient Fossils. But it was cool having a dinosaur bone in front of you, you know? Something from like a million years ago. Alright. Alright, next box topper, Bryce Harper for the Nets. Uh, J. Robin, 38. I think that's your second box topper, I believe. 
I think could be wrong. All right, last box. Let's see what we got here. Good luck, everyone. Frankie Lindor again. Unisphere. Reyes. Couple of D-backs. You want to but it's insert. You got a Ty Cobb, Ty Cobb, Ty Cobb black border. Detroit Tigers. All right, we got a Ricky Wright 1987 buyback, and it looks like it's faded and I don't know, not the greatest looking card right there. All right, Bell. Uh, Dickerson A and G back short print for the Rays. Nolan Ryan, what a day. Uh, Lumberjack dude. I don't think I've ever seen that one. Oh, beat hard. You know, we got um a one of one beat hard out of uh, contenders. Contenders that came out. I think that was like, yeah, CJ Bittard, beat hard. I don't know how you pronounce his name, but. We got the one of one auto, uh, the, what was it, the Super Bowl auto out of Contenders. And they say he's a pretty good player. Manea. Gabe Alvarez, Detroit Tigers buyback. Oh, so maybe it's the Bowman Inception then. Because Topps Inception came out a little while ago. So maybe it's Bowman. All right, next relic. Salvador Perez for the Royals. Royals belong to J. Robin 38E. Congrats. Got a little Sal Perez action. All right, Rizzo, Martinez, Peter Rosenberg, Mini. Javi Baez, Mini. That's a regular Mini. Ripken and Reigns. Uh, best fish, we got Gene, Eugene, Robert, Houdin. I don't think that's Houdini. Ernie Banks, Jake Lamb. Yeah, Yankee spots all year have been going like crazy. You know, that's just... You know what? But if you pull a Judge Auto and you get lucky and get like a, a low-numbered one or something, you're going to make a lot of money on it. I guess people are willing to take that risk. Clemente. But 700, yeah, that's a big... If you hit nothing and spend 700 in one break... It's like a oof. Hopefully you get them the next day, but Jose Reyes A and G back for the Mets. Nine 
Urias, Darvish, Springer, Cabrera. You got the scout dude. Lugo, Gray, Margot, Luis Aquino, Kansas City Royals buyback. Yeah, no, that's the right attitude. I'm sorry, I would go to uh, every week, you know, every Sunday, I would go to my card store, you know, before I was breaking in. You know, I'd spend sometimes like a thousand bucks on boxes of cards. Sometimes I'd hit some nice things. You know, I'd buy like seven, eight boxes, hobby boxes. You know, some days I wouldn't buy as many, but I'd always spend a couple to a few hundred dollars every week. Sometimes closer to a thousand, and then sometimes you get nothing. That's just how it is. All right, Will Myers, and we got a Dansby Swanson relic. That's a nice one for the Braves. Uh, Kevin Shack 131K. I haven't seen his relic at all in this product. Pretty sweet. Got a black swatch there. All right. And Mitch Henniger. Right, Yasmani, Benintendi, that's the third Benintendi rookie. Winfield, Schneider Hands, Carpenter. Uh, the Heart of Darkness, required reading. Yeah, I've been collecting cards since I was like eight years old, you know. I love it. And, uh, I don't know, eBay, on the auctions, like the buyers make the market, you know. It's not like set prices like the websites. But I'm sure the websites do it by how it's selling on eBay. And, uh, you know, now the companies make so many high-end cards, this stuff gets really expensive. Just an expensive hobby, but... Some people make a nice business out of it. Derek Jeter, Martinez, Paul Goldschmidt, uh, Carlos Carrasco, A and G back. Melanson, Correa, Mazzara. But you got a lot of retired people just, uh, you know, doing this as a nice hobby. Uh, the younger kids are starting to get into this, you know. But it's mostly uh, people, I guess, around, you know, their 30s and older. But I think younger kids are really starting to get into it. A lot more than it was a couple years ago. All right, we got a frame. Let's see. All right, it's an autograph. All right, Tampa Bay Rays, Jose De Leon. Uh, Marine Corps, congrats. This guy was on the Dodgers, got traded. And now he's in Tampa Bay. <clears throat> All right, congrats, Marine Corps. We had this Schwarber black border. All right, almost done. We're going to do a hit recap afterwards. If you didn't get a hit, you'll be in a random for uh, some hobby packs and some break credit. We do it every Sunday. So uh, this break will be next Sunday's random. There'll be seven winners. <clears throat> Sun Sphere. Uh, Jacoby Jones Mini, Garrigan Trumbo,
And we're going to have more Ginter and Chrome throughout the week. Maybe something else I'll throw in there. Maybe some more Clearly Authentic. But, uh, you know, there's going to be a lot of new stuff coming out next week. The 13th Heritage comes out. That's next Wednesday. Uh, the high numbers. I don't know if there's going to be a Bellinger rookie card in there or something. Mark McGuire Mini. And then Triple Threads and uh, Bowman Chrome comes out in a couple weeks. That's going to be a really big one. I got like 10 cases of that pre-ordered. Bowman's Best, I pre-ordered a lot. We'll see how many we get. That comes out in December. But there's some baseball in uh, like the football months. But we're definitely going to break a little uh, basketball and football also. But there's always going to be baseball. Facsimile Machine, World's Fair. Uh, Mark Trumbo, A&G back. Soler, Braun, Segura. All right, Aaron Sanchez, Mini. Bogarts, Pinder, Battle of Princeton. Uh, Kenley Jansen, short print card number 336. All right, another Yuan Mankata. That's like the third one. Benintendi insert. We got a Bo Jackson mini. Regular one. I'm waiting for those Brooklyn Redbacks. We haven't hit one of those yet. Sandy Koufax. Uh, 1987 buyback. Cleveland Indians. Ken Schramm. Corey Seager. The Great Wharf. Uh, Kevin Gausman. A and G back. Um, ju -ju -ju. yeah, Tony, message me tomorrow and I'll, you know, I'll let you know the deal on that. Just Selman, Belmore, Johnny Bench, uh, Manganello Mini, Lucroy, Yastrzemski, Larkin, Or you know what? Message me after the break. You know, we're almost done. I'll be up for a little while. Gregorius, Mattingly, Gritchuk, Weeders, Battle of Lexington. All right, our first glow-in-the-dark card. Hercules. Constellation card. Um, I have no idea... You know, I just pre-ordered it. I just got to wait till I get the bill for it. You know, when the order sheet came out, there was a price on it, but I just know I ordered a bunch of it. I don't know what it's going to retail for. Like when Topps Chrome came out, that was out the gate. They were going for like 130 a box, but the pre-order price was a lot cheaper than that, you know, closer to... 70 or 80 bucks or something but that's like that's like uh wholesale i don't know what they call it wholesale or you know the distributor price pretty much like the factory price but a little more than that a few percent more all right yadier molina Johnny Damon, Sal Perez, Steele, Healy rookie card, Babe Ruth, what a day. But if Topps Chrome came out at 130 retail, no, Bowman Chrome, I'm not sure. You know, definitely over a hundred dollars a box retail. 
All right, Julio Tehran, A and G back. Yeah, I don't know. Like, there's uh, are people selling Bowman Chrome like pre-orders right now? What are they going for a box? Like, if you don't, you know, I was new, so I didn't pre-order like a ton of cases so when i had to buy like all this stuff i bought aftermarket it's a lot more money than the pre-order price you know i was paying per box on like the ginter and the chrome a lot more than the pre-order price you know probably two three hundred dollars more a case closer to like 300 i guess so now for next year i'm going to make sure i'm ordering like a lot more cases Yeah, those are the guys that uh control the market like retail wise, Steel City and Dave and Adams Card World. Alright, let's get a recap together. And let's see, four in the morning on the east coast. Gonna eat a little something after this and pass out. Oh, 95. Yeah, Topps Chrome was so big because I think the Aaron Judges. I don't think Bowman Chrome. I haven't seen like Aaron Judge autos uh, on the, you know, on the, on the advertisements for it. They show Yohan Mankata. Uh, who's the other player they showed? It was Mankata and somebody else on the cover. I think they're going to have some Bellinger autos. But Topps Chrome, yeah, Topps Chrome was known for the rookie cards. Bowman Chrome's more for the prospects. So I think that's why Topps Chrome came out at 130. And then Topps Chrome Jumbos went close to like 300 or something. They were going crazy. Okay, let's see how many hits we got. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. All right, 12 hits. There was no hot boxes or extra ones, so there's going to be a hot box in the next two breaks. You know, we got some decent stuff here. I'd say the Bradley Zimmer. We got a rip card. Yeah, no, not bad at all. We've been so used to pulling, like, those $1,000 cards that we're getting spoiled. All right, here is your hit recap. All right, we'll start with the relics. Okay, Julio Urias relic, Dansby Swanson. Uh, they're all relics, my bad. Julio Urias, LA Dodgers, Dansby Swanson, Atlanta Braves, Anthony Rizzo, Cubbies. Uh, Verlander for the Tigers, Machado for the Orioles, Salvador Perez for the Royals, Masahiro Tanaka for the Yanks, non-baseball spot Peter Rosenberg, uh, we had a nice rip card, Andrew Benintendi, 59 out of 60, alright, and... Jose De Leon, framed mini auto, Tampa Bay Rays. Uh, we got a Roman Quinn framed auto for the Phillies. And we got a really nice Bradley Zimmer, 16 out of 25 Cleveland Indians framed auto. So number to 25 Bradley Zimmer. This could be another name that starts uh, popping up. Bradley Zimmer. You know, he was a... Uh, I think he was a number five draft pick, I want to say. He was an early draft pick, so Cleveland's got high hopes for him. Pretty sweet card. Congrats to the Indians. Uh, that's it, guys. I will be back tomorrow night with uh, us, you know, the next four boxes of Allen and Ginter. We'll take the eight boxes out that are left. 
We'll roll a dice to select. Hopefully we get the hot box in there. Some monster hits. Uh, there was some other nice cards. Some nice minis. Uh, nice Mankata Black Border. Uh, everything's going to ship out Tuesday. Uh, thank you, Frankie. Good night. Uh, what was there? A couple of Aaron Judge cards. You know, a couple of Mankatas, Benintendis. I think there were three Mankatas, three Benintendis. All cards ship. You'll get every single card. Uh, Monday's the holiday, so post office is back in operation on Tuesday. So I'll have an extra day to sort out stuff. That'll be good. But you guys will get it a day later. Uh, if anybody needs me, you know where to reach me. Good night, guys. Thank you all very much. Uh, so Allen and Ginter tomorrow night. We got Topps Chrome. I'm doing another break of that on Thursday and Friday night. And uh, maybe we'll throw something else uh, through the weekend. I just got to see what the distributors got uh, on Tuesday. All right. Thank you, guys. Tony, good night. Tony, text me. Later, later, JJ.